Yo, tubers, what is good? I have not been on here in a second, man. I've been so focused on music videos. But in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys three creative angles that you can do for your music videos. So let's jump right into the video. So the first angle is a wide angle shot. So basically for the shot, to achieve this shot, all you need is a tripod and your camera, and you need a wide angle lens. For this, I'm using the 16 millimeter, uh, the Canon 16 millimeter RF mount uh, for this. So one thing you wanna make sure you do, or have your talent do, um, when they're doing this performance is you want to make sure that they're very very close to the lens It's gonna make their head look bigger and the background's gonna look like on the edges It's gonna look super narrow from what I've noticed from doing this uh, angle um, You want to make sure your talents really close to your lens like this close Like you want to make sure they're like really close, but as you can see it's still it's still kind of wide You know what I mean? It's not like super punched in you know what I mean? It's still wide You know what I mean? He's just very very close to or I was just very very close to the lens So that is one creative angle that you can use for your music videos the next angle we're going to talk about, I'm sure you guys have heard this angle, but I use this angle a ton in music videos, and it's called a Dutch angle. A Dutch angle is basically your camera basically rotated like that. A Dutch angle is just like, for me, it gives me a very suspenseful feeling, and it's just a, an angle that is very, very intriguing, and it's just a super dope angle. So. so how you achieve this angle is you can either use a gimbal, or you can either use a tripod, or you can just do it handheld. Yeah, so basically a Dutch angle is literally just like rotating your frame. So that's a pretty easy one to achieve and the last and the last angle is a top down angle i'm sure you guys have heard of that one as well top down angles are one of my favorite angles to do all you would need for this is like a c-stand or you can get like an arm that has a clamp on it that you can put onto something but it's very very easy to achieve a top down angle so top down angles are very eye-catching and that's why i like using them a ton because they're very very eye-catching and they're just they're just dope in general like typically when i'm working with an artist or talent is what i like to call them um i usually either have them lay like lay down somewhere i think it looks super dope when someone's laying down or you can have them sitting getting some shots of their hands doing whatever there's a ton of things you can do with the top down angle though yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video man i have not been on youtube in a minute just because i've been so focused on music videos i haven't really been into you know like posting things right now <laughs> like i don't know that's just how i've been feeling lately i feel like a lot i feel like nowadays i feel like numbers are being watched more than anything i don't want to be that type of person i want to be able to create freely so i haven't been uploading to youtube i've just been trying to create and have fun and you know put out projects when i feel feel like it's the right time to i'm not in any rush but yeah guys i know this was a short video but i hope you guys enjoyed this video man make sure you guys crush that like button click that notification bell to get notifications when i upload to this channel hit that subscribe button and i will catch you guys in the next vid peace